Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be really exciting, at least I, I think so. Um, I'm going to be transforming myself from this to an e-girl. And I'm super excited because I feel like my style is the complete opposite of an e-girl. Um, I could probably never pull it off, hence why I really want to see what I look like. I have some like hot pink hair extensions that I bought that I'm going to put in towards the end. I got a fake nose ring and everything, so I'm super excited. Let's just get straight into it. Because I feel like the e-girl look mainly focuses on like the eyes and the cheeks and stuff, I'm going to do my base, like my foundation, concealer, and eyebrows first, and then I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I've done my brows. I kind of did like a lighter brow. I'm experimenting with soap brows recently, so I'm not sure how it looks. I'm still getting used to it. I've done my foundation, concealer, and powder, and then I'm just going to start with the e-girl part of this look. Um, according to Cosmo, well, I must drop this. According to Cosmo, um, it says eco makeup looks consists of thick winged eyeliner, faux freckles, heavy drunk blush, highlighter strategic highlighter strategically placed on the high points of the face, and peach glossy lips. Cute little hearts or stars are also stamped on the cheeks or underneath the eyes. So we are going to start with just the eyes first. I know the Eagles looks don't have a ton of eyeshadow, but I do have a little bit of like a pinkish color. So I'm just gonna take my Mellow Cosmetics Sinopia palette and I'm just going to take the blush shade. It's more of a brown blush but I just want to put a little bit of color onto my eyelids. Let's try to do some thick ass eyeliner. I'm going to try the Maybelline Hyper Easy Eyeliner today. I actually just picked this up the other day and I've never tried it before so hopefully it doesn't like skip or bleed on me. Ooh, I love the sleek packaging. I need to bring my mirror closer. Let's see. Ooh. This is a really nice brush tip applicator. I like that. I actually don't even think you guys can see this. Let me just do this off camera and I'll be right back. Okay, I've done my eyeliner and I've popped on some lashes because I have itty bitty lashes. And then now I'm going to attempt to just draw an uh a heart at the bottom of both my eyes. I don't know how this is gonna go. This eyeliner glides on like butter, like it's almost too easy to use that I feel like it's just gonna slip everywhere. <laughs> but if you guys want a really, really easy gliding eyeliner, this is the one for you. Okay, I don't even know where to start with this. Do that. And then fill it in, something like that. I'll do that to this eye. Well, you know, this one looks more like a turd ball than a heart, but that's okay. I'm just gonna stop before it gets really out of hand. Okay, now is the fun part. We get to do the blush. I am going to go really heavy handed, basically. Let me take a cream blush first, actually. I'm taking my Natasha Denona palette, and I'm just going to be packing on this blush like crazy. I'm really sorry if I'm like turning that way too much. It's just my mirrors there. So this is so weird to see myself like this. Oh, how's that? I feel like it's still not enough. Okay, let's take some of this powder blush and just start sweeping it on. I'm just gonna quickly do my normal contour routine. I actually haven't bronzed, but I don't think I really need to bronze. Just need to contour this chin a little bit. Is that even blended? Honestly, I don't know why this lighting, I just can't see. There's like the light from outside and my artificial lighting and I'm just confused going to take my blush and just do a little bit more. I don't think I've had this much blush on in my entire friggin life. An eternity later. I think that's good enough for me. Then we're going to draw on some freckles. I've never drawn on freckles 
but I think what I'm gonna do is take my um, what's this my eyebrow brush and just do little nicks I don't even think this is gonna show up this is not gonna show up well let me take a dark brown on my eyeliner brush and we're just going to start doing dots on the face my mom would totally freak out if I actually had this many freckles because you know Asian moms and them being like freckles are bad I'm going to blend it a bit with a sponge oh gosh this is horrible <laughs> I don't look like I have freckles. I look like I freaking have marks on my face. That's pretty much what it looks like. I think it it could be a lot worse. So we're just gonna leave that. I'm going to quickly highlight my face now. I am going to just take my blush palette. I've been just using this palette a lot lately. So I'm going to really highlight the tip of my nose and the bridge so that it's, you know, very glossy. I'm just going to highlight a little bit up here. So it gives you that sheen. I'm just gonna take a nude lip liner and just quickly line my lips a little bit. And then I'm just gonna take my Fenty Gloss. So here is the finished look. I think it's really cute like it's really adorable for sure I'm going to now um, put in these hair extensions that I got these are like hot pink I think I'm gonna try to put them like right here I will go figure that out really quickly and I'll be right back okay so here is how we're going I decided to just clip it at my roots and change my hair to a middle part which I normally would never do but we're just gonna cut off the top of my head so you guys can actually see what it's looking like these dents really are annoying the heck out of me I feel like I can't even focus because of these dents let me go get some water and try to tame them a little bit okay so here is the finished look oh my god literally as I was packing up I remembered I still had these septum piercings can't believe I forgot about it let's do a rose gold one these fake septum piercings, obviously. Wow. Here is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed, and um, if you guys would like to see me transform or do anything else, let me know in the comments below. I can't stop staring at myself, and this is really itchy. So I am going to sign off now. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.